Hey, today I want to show how to fix one uh, uh, problem in Warcraft 3. So uh, we have, uh, we can uh, go to the Terran editor like here, and uh, if we uh, let's take a big brush with upward, so we can uh, do this kind of uh, water here, and uh, this brings this water mesh uh, here. Uh, this this level, which is now cliff level 5 for me, because I started the map with cliff level 6. And uh, then if we just uh, undo the terrain like this, like uh, uh, applying the same cliff level, uh, actually now there still is the water mesh there, but uh, it's not uh, active at the moment. So the problem is that uh, if we Afterwards, doing like this, we do a couple of uh, levels like this, lower, and uh, and then uh, somehow uh, edit the map so that you can enter actually there. We can see that the the, the mesh is here at the level five, uh, water mesh, invisible water mesh here. And uh, actually, the ground mesh is here at level zero in this map, here at the bottom. And uh, actually, it doesn't cause so many problems. The the only problem which it causes is with the uh, area area of effect uh, spells and items. So um, uh, let's have a look. I have now. I have uh, actually made. Um, uh, uh, map with this uh, problem and it's here okay you see I have here arc mage and then I have uh, this area which has the water mesh there and actually I can enter there okay here is my arc mage I just started walk well. three and uh, arc mage has this blizzard Area what? of effect spell, and uh, he has also uh, healing wards in his Whatever. inventory. I go here where the problem uh -huh. is, and uh, I can show it best with the uh, healing wards. So um, you see, like uh, if I try to put the healing wards according to this uh, air effect uh, uh, cursor. Um, I try to put it, let's say, in front of Archmage here. Cool. It actually puts it in a different place. And the place is actually where the invisible uh, cursor is. So you can see also if I bring cursor down here, it uh, jumps uh, a small distance north. And uh, But actually where it comes is where the invisible cursor is. So this is the problem that the, uh, this water mesh, uh, which is invisible and is disabled, uh, causes with this area of effect abilities. Now to fix the problem, uh, we need to do some uh, prerequisites here. And one is that we need to install Java runtime environment. So that's called GRE. And uh, you can find it on Google, you go here and uh, you can download it here from Oracle and uh, you need first to accept the license agreement uh, and then you can download from here uh, for example this file and install it on your computer then you can run Java applications. The other thing that you need to do is to download WinMPQ and this you can find from Hypeworkshop. So you just uh, try to find this one, for, for example, with the search, and then you just download it. And uh, this is the other program that you need. Now, then when uh, you extract the WinMPQ zip, uh, you should have uh, this kind of uh, border structure. So. Uh, these two one, first ones are uh, something that you need to install before the uh, Win MP people can run. So you first install this VBR for here. Just click the setup, and it should install. Uh, I, and then uh, when it installed, you just 
go to here to run back tree and install the setup here and if everything goes right then you should be able to be go here and uh, run winmp go here so uh, i have already installed uh, everything so you should, should see this kind of uh, window the next thing to do is to download our water height fixer and it's a java application so here's the zip file you can extract it uh, here you can extract it to any folder you want to and you should see something like this uh, in the extracted files so here is the jar file uh, which is our executable and uh, you can click it like this and uh, if you have the java runtime environment installed correctly uh, it should start and, and look like this okay but we cannot use this water height fixture right away uh, we need to use uh, winmpq first and uh, i have here in my uh, work of tree test maps directory i have a uh, work of tree map and uh, this is uh, the map which I have generated with a, with a problem which I showed earlier. The next thing is to open WinMPQ. With this program we can open uh, the map archives and uh, here's the map with the problem which I showed you earlier. Uh, we can see because it immediately because it's a reign of chaos file, w3m file. Uh, usually these files are frozen tron files so w3x files and you cannot see them immediately but you need to select all files and uh, then it will let you open uh, the frozen tron w3x files but here we have this uh, normal rain of case file and we can open it and uh, it shows its uh, contents and uh, these are different uh, map data and what we are interested in is this watery map w3e file and we need to extract uh, this file somewhere and let's uh, extract it to my test maps uh, directory here is the test maps directory in file explorer and you can see that the watery map dot uh, w3e file is there uh, this is the file we want to uh, fix and and then we need to launch the water height fixer uh, I have already it here open so you, you, you must double click the chart file to open it and uh, we can fix it uh, right here from the toolbar there's the fix button so we click fix then go to test maps and then we blind, and uh, like this and now it's fixed if everything went well uh, everything should be fixed here and uh, we can close uh, this file and uh, then we need to re-import uh, this fixed file uh, into into the map I recommend doing a copy of, of the map uh, so, so that we don't uh, accidentally destroy the original map if something goes wrong let's put it like fixed here then uh, let's go to winmpq open fixed um, and it's now open here we need to delete the old one so delete yes let's delete it and uh, then add this again here and this can be empty and now it's there and then we can close winmpq now we can uh, open the fixed file in uh, here in the world editor we can see see that it works but of course we cannot see here that if it is fixed actually and of course to check if it is fixed we can start it here okay now i have a water tree uh, started here with the fixed map so um, um, we can see actually like i was also checking that it doesn't destroy the rolling shores here so they are okay uh, i didn't show them earlier but uh, they were also there on, uh, on the Good. south side and now we Good. go here right away to the problem area 
uh, all the way well, here. I can hardly wait. And let's try healing wards. Look. And perfect. It goes where it should go. And if you put the other one, you can see where my cursor is. And it just goes to the right uh, place. So the problem is fixed. And uh, this is very, very good because this uh, problem is very hard to fix sometimes uh, by manual means, but by running this uh, work water height fixer, it's very easy to fix it and everything is immediately correct in your map. 